preventing accidental shootings. Over the last two years, we've seen multiple children shot because they had access to a gun. Most recently, a three-year-old in Roanoke. Search warrants show he shot himself in the head at home. 10 News anchor Jenna Zipton shows us what every parent should make sure their child knows. I learned to shoot when I was five years old and I shot this 22 right here. Gun safety has been drilled into Luke Tyler from a young age. If you see a gun, do not touch it. Leave the room and tell an adult. And if somebody is pointing it at you, you leave the room as fast as you can and tell any adult that you know. At just seven years old, he knows what can happen. And there was a gun on the table and the nine-year-old picked it up and accidentally shot his 12-year-old brother. And when you heard that story, what did you think? I thought he should have known better. And now he's going to know all, all of his life that he killed his own brother. When you think about and hear about a, ch a child that's had access to a firearm, you know, my first thought is, why do they have access to it? Mitchell Tyler is Luke's dad and the co-owner of SafeSide Tactical. There's just no excuse for a, an adult with a firearm in the, in the home uh, to, to make it accessible to a young child. The triggers are easy enough to pull for a two, three-year-old. There's something that we're wired with to want to pull the trigger. That's what it's there for. SafeSide started a class for kids called First Shots. Kids as young as six can learn about gun safety and shoot on the range. Part of what I like about First Shots is trying to take some of that mystery out of firearms, and I think that um, that's a parenting technique that I use. Don't make it the forbidden fruit. Don't make it so that when you go to that neighbor's house and they see a gun for the first time that they want to pick it up and pull the trigger. He also has another rule in his house. We really didn't do the realistic toy guns in our home, and that was from a very young age. The firearms that are made to look real, we really never wanted our children to practice unsafe gun handling in a toy environment or a pretend environment where at some point they may be in a real life environment with a gun that looks exactly the same and I can't expect a child's mind to switch that quickly. For Luke, he looks forward to the few times he shot at the range and always practices Good. safety. Wait, I got four bullets. Nice. I got five bullets on. Finger off the trigger till you're ready to shoot. You treat a gun as if it is loaded. First shots cost about $15. The gun, ammo, and supplies are included. More than 100 people took the first class last August. It's about three hours, and they still have spots left for this weekend's class. Gun locks are about $10, and a gun safe starts at 15 there are many places you can pick up a free gun lock. We've listed those on WSLS.com, along with the info about the First Shots class. Jenna Zimpton, 10 News, working for you.